Thank you for joining us. Today we're discussing the static braking system used in Packer & Wentz products under the Braden brand name. Many Braden winches and hoists have both a static brake and a dynamic brake. This system allows for very precise load control under varying conditions. It is often duplicated but never equaled as every component is designed specifically for winches and hoists. The static brake system is composed of many components including brake cylinder, brake springs, metal brake discs, friction discs, and a motor adapter. Also, various spacers and seals are included in the assembly. The metal brake discs are keyed to the inside of the brake cylinder, and the friction discs are keyed to the outer race of the brake clutch. The brake springs mechanically compress the metal brake discs and the friction discs. Since the brake clutch is locked in the lowering direction, the load is held in place. The static brake is spring applied and hydraulically released. This ensures the load will be held even if the hydraulic system fails. When lowering or paying out, hydraulic pressure is directed to the brake cylinder. This compresses the brake springs and releases the clamping force on the metal brake disc and the friction disc. This allows the load to lower or pay out. However, the load is still somewhat held in place by hydraulic fluid trapped in the dynamic braking system, which is detailed in our next video. For additional information, contact your local distributor or go to PackerWinch.com.